Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis, and I want to let you know that tonight at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time, I'm going to be releasing the next episode in the Alien Invasion series. And this episode is about water, getting access to clean water. If you have access to dirty water, there's things that you can do to make that water uh, appropriate for bathing or cooking or, you know, even directly drinking. And that's what we're talking about in this uh, tonight's episode. It's a really important topic because the, it's a big issue facing a lot of people increasingly in the world as, you know, disasters and challenges continue to kind of envelop our societies all over the planet. You know, this is a really big issue for a lot of people. Uh, the other thing I want to mention is that if you are a fan of the Alien Invasion series and you would like to share it with other people, I would encourage you to go ahead and do it. Uh, the first season of Alien Invasion, which was released kind of before the world was in a constant state of nonstop uh, trauma, uh, was a very popular series. Hundreds of thousands of people watched that series, and this second season, uh, it's maybe a couple hundred. Uh, there's, a, a bit, there's a bit of a differential between the two seasons. Uh, you know, the quality level has only gone up. So what I think is probably going on is just, you know, people maybe, uh, in the past, people wanted to fantasize about this stuff, but maybe today, today people don't feel the need to fantasize because uh, you know, much of the world is in a constant state of turmoil already, so maybe people don't uh, feel like they need that. But you know, a lot of people don't realize that the series is about teaching these real practical skills that could help a lot of people. So if you like the series and you would like to share uh, you know, your appreciation of it and your, um, your, the knowledge that's available in the series with other people, it can't do anything but help us because the more that we can spread these uh, lessons out to a broader world, the more it kind of helps all of us because, you know, if you think about it, if you're in a crisis situation and you're the only one that's prepared and everyone around you is completely unprepared, that's going to be a really difficult situation for you. Um, a little bit less so if you're prepared and a lot of the other people around you are prepared too. So it helps to kind of take these lessons, share them out to a broader world. Uh, it can't do anything but make your life easier in one of these crisis situations if there's less other people that are, are kind of like completely terrified and have no idea what to do. So if you'd love to share it on social media or whatever, it could be helpful. Um, you know, one way or the other, YouTube kind of figures out some way of taking all the advertising revenue from the channel. Uh, you know, so I mean, it doesn't make a huge difference to me other than the idea that I do this series, I put in a crap load of work into it, and I'd love, it to, uh, I'd love for more people to benefit from it. I know a lot of people benefited from the first season, Thousands of people subscribe to my channel saying, hey, we want more of this, but YouTube hasn't been letting them know about it. Uh, and, uh, you know, the information is uh, it's coming out of my lips and then it's just kind of sort of like dying there. Uh, I think it would be better for all of us if we can just get these messages out more. So if you enjoy this series, you want to share it with other people, if you got social media contacts, whatever, share it around. YouTube is not doing their part of the bargain in notifying people. So it's up to you and I if we want to make our world more prepared and more resilient which really makes things better for all of us. That's it. Thanks for watching and see you tonight at 8.30 when I'll be wearing much shabbier clothes. And I think I'll, and I have more facial hair and I'm itchier and I look dirtier. <laughs> Thanks for watching. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.